Hello there folks, today we're going to check out the trial version or the demo version of Resident Evil 7 that was released for the PC on the 19th of December. Now I just downloaded this game, um, it's about three and a half gigs. Uh, it was available on Steam. I've I've got to say that the game itself is pretty incredible. Um, if you look back at the Resident Evil franchise, it's probably what defined or redefined the survival horror genre. If you ever wanted to actually play a survival horror game, um, you don't have to look beyond Resident Evil. So the first Resident Evil came way back in... Um, 1996, 1998, probably. Um, and there have been about, I don't know, about 15 or 16 versions of the game since then. Seven versions in sequence as such, but there have been so many other side side stories and side plots which have made them made it into games themselves. Um, you sort of over time lose track. But nonetheless, um, here it is, Resident Evil 7. I'm going to skip through most of the cutscenes and get straight to the playthrough. And we'll sort of take it from there. What you hear from now is an actual first experience reaction to everything that you see on screen. All right, here we go. All right, so this is the Resident <sighs> Evil 7 teaser, beginning R as it's called. Alright, I'm on the floor. Visuals look pretty impressive. <sighs> so let's get out of the house. It doesn't look like a place I'd want to stay in any case. Videotape. Alright, I'm guessing I have to find a videotape. Oh look, a piano. Damn. That is actually scary. Fuse. A fuse is missing. That... that if you play all of the Resident Evil games, you'll realize there's always some fuse or some electrical component missing somewhere. Alright, there's a piece of paper. It says, I shall dash them against the stones. The music's pretty impressive so far. Quite atmospheric. So this sort of seems to be like a breakaway from the regular third-person view of Resident Evil. My god, visually it looks stunning. Look at the mold. Alright. Oh wow, look at those. Oh, they're actually moving. Damn cool. This... This is definitely scary. It doesn't seem to be a reflection that I can that I can look at. All right, the stairs above. I am not going there right now. The detail is stunning on this. Is something going to break through the wall? Refrigerator. Oh god, that's disgusting. The realism is just uh no, 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 it's gone to a different level. Oh, wow. That is gross. Look at the rust on the microwave. Wow. I see roaches there. It's for dinner. Oh god. Oh shit. If this was actually on the PlayStation VR, that would be pretty disturbing. Let's close the tap. Okay. This has a very Texas Chainsaw Massacre feel to it. It doesn't 
doesn't feel Resident Evil. So chain, chain shut, which means I'll find something to probably break it. Why can't these doors just open fully by themselves? Oh god, is that a carcass? Is that a cow? Is that a horse? Well, look at this. I guess that's my first weapon. Or I can use that to actually cut the chains. Check inventory. Alright. How do I use this? Do I get to carry it? Do I have to equip it? I can only examine the item. Okay, I mean, looks like your standard cutter. Let me see if I can... Oh, okay, so I click and then, okay. Oh, okay. What's that? Derelict house footage. Do I any other items here? Check news? Nope. Seems to be a door that I can get out. The fuck? Did that? Where did the baby come from? You could get. Oh, I need to find a key. Okay. So, so I know now. I know where the videotape goes, and I know that I have to go and put the key. I have to go and find a key. Well, let's go on top. There's a button. What does this button do? It's not responding. Oh fuck, mannequins. That for a second was scary. Very I am legend feel to it at this point with the mannequins and stuff. Did they just are they looking how did they turn? And they Holy shit. Okay. Where the where the other one go? There were three there. Okay, this is this is trying to actually get creepy at this point. There's a growling of some sort. Oh shit! All right. TV's on. How convenient. Was it on earlier? Let's just put the tape in. Let's see where this is at. Probably some kind of clue. Alright. June 1st, 2017. Is this like a reality show? Boo! Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Okay, so... This new guy? Oh, you can move. I'm not feeling it. Again? Oh, okay. So I guess this is where your... Uh, so you get to play we do a the character in the, the tape. First, then we shoot the intro. And I'm Just guessing like this would give you clues Just that you can actually use when you are... No problem. Not on the tape. Tonight on Sewer Gators, I hope that makes sense. Another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. Visually, this looks brilliant. It looks amazing. This has a more Resident Evil feel to it now. Are we rolling? All right, let's go. <clears throat> Get out of the way. I'm guessing this guy in the jacket was the one in the was the one in the intro video initially. If you haven't seen it, you can obviously check it out online. But after you. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? One of these guys is definitely gonna die. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know. We can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing.
What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long do you say this place has been abandoned? So this is the kitchen that we were in earlier. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. This will make a great cutaway. Well, let me try and open this again. So, uh, Hope there are no roaches. Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit! I know I should have worn my good shoes. Oh, shit. Glad What's I had my that? shots. Is it a clue? Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? Andre! No, oh, this Andre. is where it begins. Clancy, you see where Andre went? I think. Where is he? Unfucking believable. This is the last time I work with that guy. Should I go up for this? I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. All right, I'm gonna stick with you. I don't see the voodoo dolls there. I don't see the mold on the doors. So I'm guessing this is... What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. Let's... Let's go in because... That is what the story is telling us to do. Andre! Where the fuck is he? This looks genuinely scary at this point. Andre, where are you, man? Okay, let's let's stick close to this guy because he obviously knows what he's doing. Okay, he decided what to close the, the fireplace. What's that? Is you that, gotta be fucking kidding me! Is that a... All right, new deal. We we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Alright. Okay. I think we should just go. Okay, crouch, okay. So this is a new movement mechanic. See to stand. Okay, great. Good deal. Okay, so I'm supposed to go down. Oh look, I see him there. You first. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So uh you first. Okay. Okay, there he is. What do you see? What is it? I can almost feel a cliched horror moment coming on. <laughs> Holy shit. Ah! Oh, damn. That is going to give me some nightmares. Oh, look, there's somebody there. Oh, shit. Okay. That was genuinely scary. Okay, the tape's done. Okay, what's... That wasn't there earlier. Holy shit, I should... Okay. It changed them to you. That means whoever it is knows. How's he doing this? Okay. I think we need to go pull that lever because the video tape gave us a clue. I reckon that this is going to be a theme where you play, you weave in and out of the past and the present, and these video tapes give you clues. Maybe. I'm, I'm just guessing. There's a key. It's a back door key. Do I dare to go down? Nope. Don't have the guts to do it. That is scary. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go... and figure my way out of this place now. I have the back. Holy shit. I knew it. 
I knew he's gone. Oh, something's moving around somewhere. I am just gonna make a dash for this. Holy shit. Where is the, that was the missing mannequin. Just run, run, just run for... Okay. Okay, use the key. Where's the key? There it is. Alright, freedom. <laughs> Welcome to the family, son. <laughs> Damn. Okay, while that was scary, the guy didn't look scary. Sort of has like a... The hills have eyes. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Okay, now we're back to the cutscene. This is the beginning. Well, this is where it stopped exactly. Now it's picking up from here. We gotta get the hell out of here. Oh shit! Oh, shit. oh damn! Well, they're both dead. Okay. Oh shit! Okay. This game is genuinely scary. If this hasn't convinced you to buy it, then... Well, it has convinced me to buy it. Well, as the story says, uh, as the title here says, Jan 24, 2017, you can purchase this now on Steam. This is going to be awesome. I think I'm sold on the concept. I'm probably not sold on the first person view yet, but... Um, Oh look, there's the Resident Evil Ambassador program. No, I don't know what that means. All right, folks, that's pretty much it from from uh, from my end. I I love the demo. The initial thoughts were that it didn't have a Resident feel, a Resident Evil feel to it, uh, which is typically your third-person shooter with campy enemies and you know scare uh, and and a lot of jump scares coming at you from different uh, you know parts of uh, parts of the world. But I think this this is genuinely scary, and I can tell you that it's it's a departure from the standard third-person shooter. But um, but I like it, and I think I'm pretty much convinced to buy the full version when uh, you know when it releases. Um, I'll probably pre-order it now, and then you know pick up whatever bonuses that come with the pre-order. But all in all, I hope you guys liked it. Um, you know, continue to stay tuned to our channel for more. Resident Evil stuff and uh, anything else that comes in the way in the form of comics, movies, video games. So do subscribe and uh, like, share and comment. Thank you.